I came because I feel that Meek represents thousands of people in Pennsylvania and even tens of thousands around the country that uh, have been victimized by abusive probationary and parole systems that give room for judges to act way beyond what is necessary, what is palpable, and in my judgment, what is ethical. If you can do this to a successful artist like Meek Mill, you can do this to many around the country. And that is why I wanted to come and why I wanted to say that he is representative of something far more than his stardom. He's a symbol of the abuse of the system that will violate you over nothing and end up ruining the potential and the ability to move forward in life. Let's not forget, this young man did his time as, a, as, as what he was, was given uh, as a youngster for a childhood or teenage era and was on paper over and over and over again ever since and violated at whim. And this is representative of too many. I would hope this judge looks at the fact that when you put someone of this background away for a violation that was not even charged in one case, and another case was dismissed, that you're really exposing a ruthlessness in the system that should be changed. And I would appeal to her to look at this and to really examine, does she want to go down as the type of person that would do that? I don't think she does. I would ask her to reconsider or at least step aside and have someone else evaluate and say, well, maybe they can look at it and look at the ramifications of it differently. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.